Hello, Laura here from p5audio.com and today I'm going to show you how to import Apple Loops into your GarageBand project. So the first step of what you're going to do is go to your finder and locate the Apple Loops that you want to import. And I just downloaded ATL Players Club from P5 Audio and I'm going to use Loop Set 10. So I'm going to take all of these Apple Loops which are part of Loop Set 10 and drag them directly from the finder into the project and that's all you have to do. That's how you import. Since they're Apple Loops we can also change the pitch, we can change the tempo very easily. Let's see if that's something we want to do. Um, we definitely want to change the tempo a little bit. I think it's a little bit fast. You can see here I'm just panning a couple things so I can hear it better. Um, let's try that. Okay, so in order to change the tempo and change the pitch, you click this little scissors icon here. You make sure follow tempo and pitch is highlighted you go to this LCD screen right here and you click there and select project. Now we can change the key and the tempo. So I want to make it a little slower to start off. Maybe just let's try 77. And then let's try making it a little lower. at C sharp. Now let's make it um, let's make it B minor and see how we sound. Okay, I like that much more. Let's drag it out for a little bit and that's all you gotta do. Thanks for listening. ATL Players Club